Hello, everybody. Welcome back. This is Tinker77, and we are again back on the QTech world. And it's again in the morning, so let me have my coffee. Mm -mm. Mm. Yeah, got to get going here. So yesterday, we were working on trying to get that digital miner. And we ran into some trouble when we're trying to get, uh, what was it called? Something with this eye of Ender. Let's go look at the digital miner really quick. We were trying to build this, the Ender core. And this Ender core took energizing and it took the eye of Ender. It takes dielectric casing and a basic capacitor tiny. So we're gonna start in with this today. That's gonna be kind of fun. I can't wait. I just wanna tell you though, I do stream over on Twitch and I stream on YouTube both. Okay, so I've got some questions about that. Yes, I kind of rotate between the two. I like to make sure that I get some exposure to both uh, platforms for people who want to watch stream. So look for it on both places. If you're not signed up over on Twitch, go over there and uh, follow, and then you'll get some notifications when I go live over there, okay? So now let's get started here. I did a little bit of testing uh, earlier, trying to figure out this whole entire uh, system for what we need to do. And it looks like we need to make this energizer orb thing, and we need to make this energizing rod. These two are critical for making that piece that we need. So let's start to work on that right now. Okay, so we need one of these dielectric casings and some dielectric rods, horizontal, and some, looks like some glass. So do we have dielectric casing anywhere? I don't see it. I think we used it in making something. So we may have to make that, and that might be the first bit that we have to do with some of this here too. Okay, so let's make the dielectric casing. If you can see here, it takes refined iron. We have to make a bunch of that, and it takes two and two and two. Okay, so let's get the refined iron first. And I know we're going to make a few of these, so let's just make some of this. It just takes iron and sand. Okay, and we have only 18 iron on us. That's going to be kind of tricky. Let's make, um, ooh, we're gonna need probably more than that. We're gonna probably need, wow, we're gonna need 16 of this, I think. Okay, we're gonna put that in here. Oh, we do have 16 in there, good. I was worried that we were running out of iron, but I forgot that I had some in there. So let's grab some sand and do that process. There we go, and that's gonna cook up, excellent. Okay, I was like, are there game sounds? Because <laughs> I haven't been hearing any game sounds. Uh, we need to get some more of these uh, dielectric rods, both of these horizontal and the vertical. So, what are these? It's just dielectric paste and iron bars. And dielectric paste is in the infuser, biofuel, and these wafers. Okay, and I think we have some biofuel still. We have a bunch of that. We're going to need some of this, so let's get that started. Um, first of all, let's dump out the diamonds we had there. that put in there yes so it takes pretty much all of this here we go okay so we got some more stuff going on now the idea with this system that we're trying to do here is this piece right here the energizing orb this thing will take the items we need to make okay that's what we're trying to get to because if you look here it says in the energizing orb you put in the eye of ender a dielectric casing and a basic capacitor tiny okay this thing kind of is the Thing that makes the item but what i found is you have to have an energizing rod this hooks up to your power source and it will then transmit power to this other little platform so that's what we're trying to do here guys hopefully we can do that we're going to need a lot more dielectric paste that is not going to cut it um so that means we need to make the bio fuel right yes and what was the bio fuel again how did we get that? We did um, basically in a crusher, any form of leaves or tall grass. Okay, and if we have any leaves in here. Yes, we do. So we're gonna have to make pretty much all of this up. Okay. We're gonna turn the game sounds down. I'm gonna take a drink here. There we go. So we are again trying to make the empower. This are not empower the energizer, and this one takes again a dielectric casing, which we can make that, and then we make 
We need two more dielectric rods, and that's more dielectric paste. And I don't think we have any more paste in here at all. I don't see any, so that's what we're kind of uh, held up on now. There's some fuel. Okay, so we know we're going to be using that. And we need to make those wafers again. Oh, the rabbit hole, guys. This is just uh, eight coal and eight sand. Do I have eight coal? I have six coal. Tell me I've got coal. We may need to go get some more resources. I was hoping that I would have enough for this entire project today. And it is not looking like it. So let's, uh, you know what? Let me dump some of the stuff out here and we'll just go find some coal. That seems like a good idea. I probably should make up some torches before I go down. This shouldn't take too long. <laughs> torches. Gonna use my uh, coal for that, right? That's just terrible. Yeah, we're gonna use up the coal just for torches. Okay. But that's okay, because you know it's pretty easy to find coal. Okay. Let's go on down. Let the stuff process while we try to figure out how to get our the coal. Now, I've been running through when I was doing the stream. We were down here in the mine shaft, kind of exploring a little bit. You can see I've lit a lot of stuff up, but there is still coal down here. I think I went this way. I think I was kind of working on the section here. Now, we did find a lot, and I mean a lot of uh, spider spawners in the area. So we haven't gone down this way. Okay, might as well get some of these ores while we're here. Bismuth. Okay. What we need is coal, though. And what is this? This is tin. Okay. Doing a little bit of research here. Getting all this uh, material. Come on. Give us some coal. Not seeing much, are we? Osmium. That's useful. Hmm, bauxite. Is there any coal down there? I don't see any coal. I don't really want to go down there if I don't see anything. So, uh, yeah, we're not going to go down there. <laughs> we're going to go back here. See if we can find any coal. We need a lot of coal for all these projects we're going to be working on here. Okay, let's go this way. And there is some coal. That looks like a good amount. Okay, I guess I was here. Look, you can see there's another one of those spawners. And I think I went past it. And did I even get into these chests? Yes, I did get this chest. This is a zombie spawner, so we have that. That's good. I think this is about the extent that I went. Kind of like out of the mine shaft if we go the other way. There's some coal up there. Zinc, I've got zinc. I don't really need that. I haven't seen a reason why I need to use it. Yet, I'll probably, you know, I'll probably get into something I need sink really quick. But there's some coal. Okay, vein mine that. Excellent. Okay, here's some trouble. A little bit of drama here, guys. Thank you. No coal there, but I do have some coal up here. Yeah, that'll give us some coal. That's excellent. Okay. We got over a stack of coal now, so that's pretty good. Let's uh, just see if we see any more really fast. I mean, there are torches here. That means I've been here. I probably cleaned a lot of this out. So. But you never know. I might have left some. Nope. I don't see anything there. Let's go back home. Three seconds later, we're going to be home. There we go. Okay, so we have the coal. And we want to basically make... Um, we're trying to make the dielectric... Or not the dielectric, the... Wafers, right? Coal and sand. Okay, so... Let's, um... Let's do that. I already got some sand in it. Let's do that much. That works out well. Okay. There we go. 
Gotta make some more wafers so that we can get some more dielectric paste so that we can get what we need. And you know, we've got a lot of biofuel here. Let's just throw some of that in there. Good, that's going up. I know it's kind of crazy. I'm trying to get this as fast as I can, but there's just so many little rabbit holes that we're going through that I'm trying to get it all together here. Because we're trying to make this piece first. Okay, and we just need more of the horizontal rods, which means it takes iron. And we, ooh, we didn't find any iron, did we? We didn't find any extra iron. Hmm. We need more iron. <laughs> I'm like, okay, let's go and find some iron. That's the thing. Once we get a digital miner, it will do all of this for us. And that's what we want. We want to just have set it and forget it and let it do everything it needs. Okay, let's look around here. See if we can find a tunnel we haven't been down. Like, we haven't been down over here. Please be like an iron deposit. Somewhere. Anywhere. Iron. Good. And some silver and more coal. We can always use more coal. And look at that. We found some more iron. We're just going deep here. Okay. Anything down here? Darkness. Looks like no. Does it come back out to here? This was the end of that tunnel. Okay, no, nothing here. How much iron do we get? We got seven pieces of ore doubling would give us 14, and that's not a lot. We're gonna be using a lot of iron for this uh this um refined iron, the that we have now the M there I think was a waypoint that I had set up somehow <laughs> I don't know the actual keystrokes I was told in the stream press the third button and you can do it and I was like okay so I did and it, I mean it worked I just don't remember what button it was um hmm. it's down there more iron I even labeled it more iron it's like hey you know what you need iron okay this looks promising more iron, okay. Got a couple more pieces there. We have a furnace. Is there anything in the furnace? Coal. We'll take the coal. Uh, what's down here? Tesla tight. That's something that I think we might find useful. Finding some various ores here. Now it's a little bit dark. Let me put down a torch so you can see. Make it good for the viewer. Redstone. We need some redstone too, actually. This I meant this to be like a big building episode, and it's turning out to be just a uh, <laughs> more ore gathering, and that's not what I want. Maybe I'll let this video go just a little bit longer. I hope you guys don't mind. I really wanted to get the digital miner up and running today. That was kind of my big goal. Coal. I'll take coal. Thank you. More osmium. We can always use more of that. And there's an iron. Please don't go in the lava. Thank you. We're at lava level. I thought maybe we'd find some diamonds. Diamonds are kind of been rare for me. I do have them, but I don't have a lot of them. So. How much iron do we have now? 24. That's 48 pieces of iron. I'd like to get a little bit more. There's Tesla Titan. That's always useful, like I said. It's not there. Okay. Another torch down so I can see and we'll grab this and we'll go. There we go. Okay, let's go on back. There we go. Now we have to uh, start to get this stuff converted down. And that is in this machine right here. So let's get that right away. And I'm going to put these ores. These are ores that need to be processed still into here. So we know we can grab that a little bit later. Okay, so this machine's made three of these. That's awesome. And we need our diamond saw to convert those. Can I sleep to clear the weather? Yes. It's still nighttime. Barely nighttime. That should clear the weather up. Um, should. Diamond saw. Okay. There we go. Let's get these wafers. That's a lot of wafer, but we need it. And. Okay. We're on. We're back on track here. This is the iron. And we're going to put that over here into the blast furnace. And we'll start that cooking up. Yay. Progress. 
Okay, so now we were over here. We were making, um, we're trying to make this, and we needed some more horizontal. This is some glass and a couple horizontals. And we had some dielectric paste already, didn't we? Yes. No, that's, uh, oh, I thought we didn't have enough. Oh, uh, am I just, did I just really derp? I might have just derped, guys. No, I gotta make dielectric rods. We need iron bars. Am I out of iron bars? I think we are. Okay, well. We'll make some iron bars. There we go. And we'll grab some of that and throw it back in there. Let's keep the iron coming. Okay. Need to make that and that there it is we've got the first piece the energizing orb now i'm gonna build this out here on this power line so that we can kind of like you know know how this is going i'm gonna put this uh thing right over here let's put it um right here okay that's the first piece now we got to make the energizing rod here so let's make this and again it's it's a vertical one quartz another dielectric casing so we got to get some of those vertical rods now we have four so let's make a dielectric casing there's that and then we need to make it looks like these basic capacitors which is a capacitor split so one capacitor dielectric paste refined iron and red stone alloy ingot this is the next i think puzzle here Red alloy and redstone dust. So do we have red alloy? I mean, you would think it's red. We could see it. No. So let's make a red alloy. We did that earlier as part of a a uh, quest. So we should be able to make this fairly easy. And then all it is is four redstone and iron in here. So four redstone and an iron. Okay. More iron. Make me more iron. Gotcha. Did it not make it? Did I take the iron out? I must have taken the iron out. Okay. Let me get another sip of coffee. I think that's part of my problem. Not enough coffee. Hmm. We're also going to need to make that vertical, um, some more vertical pieces. So let's do some more iron bars. Oh, we already have iron bars. No, let's don't do that yet. Let's make the vertical ones here. There we go. So we have 10 and four. That should be okay. More iron. We don't need so much sand. So let's put that together. More dielectric paste. That's good. There's the red alloy, and we're trying to make a redstone alloy, which is red that and more. So let's put some more. And we have six of the refined ingots. The refined ingots again. What was that? What that we needed for that? Sand and iron. We're going to, have to do some more of that in a second, I believe. Okay, things are progressing. I talked to myself a little bit. You know, this is kind of what happens during streams, guys. I'll sit here and I'll be like, okay, we gotta do this, we gotta do this, and then people will say something and get me completely off track, and you know who you are out there. Yes, I, you know who you are. So, <laughs> it's a lot of fun on the streams, guys. If you haven't been out, been to one of my streams, you should. Okay, and we know we're gonna need iron, iron, not that. Where, oh, that I'm like, where did I put the iron? put eight of that and not in the smelter in yeah in this thing okay i think that looks right right and we just made some more okay so let's see do we have enough for this oh silence we want the energizer right and we're making the energizing this thing right here I'm trying to make the capacitor we have our refined redstone alloy ingot. Okay. So let's make the big capacitor. There that is. And we make one to make two tiny. There's that. And we need a piece of quartz. And I did go to the nether during the stream. So there's our piece of quartz. 
Okay, now this is pretty easy. This device goes on basically on some power. And it should then be gathering power. You can see it is. And it will see the stuff we put here and it will transmit that power to it. I'm going to get this a little bit closer. I think maybe a little closer would be good. Um, let's put it right here. And now we have to put the things in it that are needed to uh, make what we want. Okay, so back to the digital miner. We're making this. We have to make the ender core. It takes eye of enders. We have that. We know how to make basic capacitors. We need two of those. We need two dielectric casings. Okay, so we're going to need more refined iron. And there we go. So we need a dielectric casing. Uh, this thing here. We're going to need at least one of those. And capacitors. There we go. And we need to get the eye of ender. Now this device, honestly, I think is way too slow because obviously we're in the, in the last levels of it. So we need one of those, which is the, the capacitor, one eye of ender and one dielectric casing. And it, this thing starts to beam power. It does. Now it's beaming it constantly, but this thing does have like a battery in it. You can kind of see the levels going down. It is trying to charge it back up, but it will eventually run out. But meanwhile, this is gaining power, and when it gets done, it will then have the item we need, and we just need to do it again. So we, while we're waiting, we need to go get another dielectric casing. So let's get some more of this, and make that. Okay, so uh, I think we're very, very close to getting this digital miner. We just have to wait on this thing here. Which you can see, this is just going to take time. We have an uninvited guest. Let's go take care of him. Let's go let's go give him a nice welcome. Hi. Thank you. And while we're up here, I should check and see if we have anything in our traps. We do have some things in here. Some nuggets things. Okay. Looks like we're not going to be able to carry everything. That's just too bad. But okay. Hey, we got some stuff. That's good. I don't have a proper door for my base, so I'm using this uh, little hole for now. That's something we need to work on. I'll probably do that in a stream. It seems like the streams might be a better place to do um, the things where we have to do stuff like that. Have to do whatever we need to do there to like get um, little decorative stuff and not machines and progress based stuff. Okay. Now we are at 22 minutes of my recording. So uh, this could take some time because this thing takes forever. This may be a closer to a 30 minute or 35 minute video. Um, I know it's a little bit longer, but hey, I'm trying to, you know, get this done today. I'd like to get the digital miner built. Maybe we won't install it and run it, but we'll get it started, at least built. But this thing takes forever. It is so slow. Time for more coffee. Mm. Now, the other thing is I could stop the video here and then finish up the video. You know, that may be a better thing because like I could do a, like another back to back and I could show the digital miner being created from this. And this is a great screenshot. We'll just do a screenshot here. There we go. Maybe I'll do that. Maybe guys, I think that's probably even a better idea. Then this episode could be about this uh, empowering thing. What's it called? <laughs> the energizing orb. We'll have something like that. I can figure that out and then you know, the next episode, we will get the digital miner. You can see we're very close. We only have a couple more pieces just to make. This takes too long. This way you don't have to sit through it. And uh, we'll, we'll do something um, tomorrow, hopefully tomorrow, with the digital miner. Okay, guys? So I want to say thank you for coming out. I do appreciate it. Hey, you know what? If you like this video, please click that like button. If you have any comments, put them down in the comment section. And if you'd like to be notified of the videos that I produce, please subscribe to this channel. And don't forget to hit the little bell icon so you get all the notifications. Okay? Thanks, guys. Have a great day. Bye-bye.